So we've um, made it to the top of this uh, first little mountain that we have to get to and um, now I've got a good view on uh, where we're heading, this another point and uh, it looks like it's going to have some pretty good glassing opportunities. So it's taken us half a day to get here, it's um, pretty thick but yeah we're going to put in the extra work to get to the spot and then hope it pays dividends over the next couple of days. Ethan, hey. how do you feel, mate? Pumps, man. What's that in the background? First stag, big body boy, and um, we did it on a backpack hunt, and we've uh, shot him across this valley, just to range to about 350. Pulled the trigger, hit him, he's gone for a dive down this hill, but um, he's, we've managed to find him, recover him, just before dark, and uh, yeah, it's our first night here, so enjoying the trip. Let's do it, let's go check him out. Yeah, he's good. I'm sure he's definitely good, huh? Pretty good. Pretty good. I'm worried about his other antler. Bit of velvet. Yeah, not bad, but. Rubbing out. Hey, give us a smile, mate. Thanks to the, uh, we'll flip him over and get back to proof you. Proof research. Proof research, three on a wind mag. Yeah, the bad thing about shooting a deer just before yeah. sunset. Walking out, in the dark. Walking out in the dark. Especially when you've got to climb rocks all the way down. Unfortunately, we spotted it. It's probably 800 
meters away, really where you don't want to shoot it because we have to go all the way down. But if it looks like a stag, I'm just trying to get the spotting scope up now and we'll see what it looks like.